U.S. Patent Office had ran into a problem about uh, developing a patent. And uh, somebody submitted a patent to the Patent Office, and uh, it was created by uh, artificial intelligence, which can do wonders thing and do them fast. Yeah, it can think up to one and subtract out to zero. But a patent was put in there, and the name of it was an artificial intelligence, a, a computer. And the, they looked at that, and they, they scratched their heads and says, no. Nope, nope, nope. So the people brought it to the U.S. For Supreme Court and say, this AI created this, which could be, could get out of hand really quickly because considering all the stuff that's being produced by artificial intelligence to rapidly uh, compute uh, chemicals and vaccines in the case. And, uh, you could always say, well, my computer made this. And so my, well, your, your, my computer goes on to do that thing. I mean, Serene just says, forget it. It is now required that anybody who submits a patent to the U.S. Patent Office has to be a human. A human name has to be on it. So if you want to put your dog or cat as pre, um, co -par partners on this or your computer by any name you want to, um, we won't accept it. it ha only humans will, have to, will be seen as people who develop this. You're using a computer to develop something to create or put molecules together. It, 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 I saw something at the American Chemical Society in Chicago this uh, last week, uh, you yeah, know, last week, um, where it, well, the software created a, a screen, you got, you got the glasses here, right, and at the same time, off the computer screen, you manipulate molecules this way. And to say, well, the software created this and these molecules here, this new, new combination of molecules, the chemicals. Well, that might be nice, but you're using a tool, but your name has to be on the patent. Your laptop, whatever you want to call it, it's not human flesh. So you can put all these molecules back you want and do anything you want and test it out and it works and everything else, but you're not going to put your name. We need a physical human name on it. So something goes wrong, we get back to you. We can't prosecute your computer, we can't prosecute you. <laughs> right. Well, I'll say. AIs know. Your patent says human only. <laughs>